darkness you want to build yeah I'm starting to build soon I'm starting to build very soon I've got the picture on Google uh, as we speak supposed to mean. I am. I don't know what you're trying to implore. But um, I will shall be starting to build any second. What you need for this, if you want to, um, do hit that right uh, that follow button. Uh, this will be going out on YouTube at some point in July. I have a Discord. that doesn't seem to be working um, why has that stopped working then? stuff alright one second Okay, now it's coming up. For some reason the chat thing isn't working. I don't know what's happening with it. Unless I need to be logged into Streamlabs maybe. Let's just try and get it working. Before we start another. So what we need for this build is we need not that. We need some bricks. Some proper bricks. We need some sandstone. Some smooth sandstone. Uh, and we need some red concrete. Or slabs of concrete if we do a red one. We do. 
Not, not like that. It needs to be. Oh, there we go. Um, red sandstone. We then need some blue concrete. Some red concrete. Uh, and some smooth quartz slabs. Now, as you can see, um, as we go over here, I've finally figured out how to do banners, which is good. We'll um, we'll take that. Yeah, we're working we're in it's back working again there is a discord right here as well some try and guess me skin what's he on about don't believe he wrote that um there's what we've built so far then so we have two eateries we've got the dining car uh, that was based on Mickey's. I really need to change the banners and put Mickey's on that one. Um, we'll do that soon. Uh, here is the Silver Lining Diner. Let's just take you inside. If you haven't seen the build yet, how I built this will be out on YouTube on I think it's Saturday this one comes out um, the dining car comes out on Friday so it's all good um, we are gonna go over the road quite far um, and put the wind Dixie in about here so it is quite spaced out because it is quite big by the looks of it. And what we need to do is we need to put the bricks down here um, and go up by 10. For 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We then need to come down. Oh, well, actually, it needs to be higher than that because we need to fit the sign on. We'll go up. like so and what we then need to do is put in a row of is that big enough yeah we can muck about with the sign uh, later on and then what we need to do is have I'm going to do it this way some blue concrete going across like that and then underneath this we need three rows of red concrete one this is just for the outline of the build we'll do all the detailing uh, shortly to and then another row of blue and that is the signage bit then here we put the bricks on down to the floor Hopefully hit like that. Okay. Let's 
take this up to the top like that because above that we need this slab we do actually need to that bit done. Then we're going to have the win I N N space. So that's that bit done. Coming down from this underneath the blue we need to take out two rows of bricks and have the smooth we need a block of quartz we need to put the block of quartz across like so and then underneath that we need to get the red concrete again and go across like so Now, it does go back a little bit um, at the top here from this bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to get the bricks and we're going to go back by four. And then out by six like so and then this bit can be filled in with bricks like this you'll see what you'll see what I'm doing in a moment there's two rows of bricks needed Okay, one, two, because I'll do the detailing um, shortly, because I need a bit of an overhang on this going under, because the actual supermarket is only like this high which is still quite tall but the sign like kind of takes over it so we'll leave that there for a, for a marker and then we need to go do the same with this side and what we're going to do is we're going to continue the quartz slab going around the edge like that and this will go around the whole of the um, edge of the building then here we need three rows of blue one two no we don't Uh, 
we need to take this out by six. Two, three, uh, uh, uh. Oh, I've used the wrong, I've used the wrong bloody materials. This actually needs to be is where the we get that. at least we can see now we're going to bring the sandstone back to there right now whoa look at all them dying right Bring that back. And then the blue concrete for this needs to go. just made some slight changes to this because of size oh um. So that's like that. We then need to do the kind of same here. Sandstone coming across like so. And then we do the same again. Three blue, two red, two quartz blocks. So three rows of blue, like this. Two red. Oh no, no, I've done it wrong. Um, there's only actually one row of red. And it's only like that and then two rows oh no then it is a row of red and then a row of white and then that goes back like so so as you can see, this is actually quite a very tall and long building. I'm just going to put one in here, another brick support because that looks like what there is and there's only half of the uh, um, picture that I can go off of this. But that is what the front should look like. Uh, for the front of this I will just put in 
the other brick front just there like So, there we have it. Then what we need to do is from here, so you've got this bit here, we then need to go back, take this back even as, what we'll do is we'll fill this bit in. with the sandstone just because we can and because really it needs to be because <laughs> you're forgetting that the side the actual supermarket sides will only be coming up to here for the rest of the building so we'll, we'll just get the outline for it Is these are quite big supermarkets This one, Dixie, is it needs coming out one more. So we do that. Connect it up to there. Break all them up. There we go. So then we will need to go into this corner here. Remember, there isn't that many windows in the supermarkets. Um, especially on this, the uh, doesn't seem to. There only seems to be a lot of light coming in off the ceiling, um, and like the only windows are like above the door. So we'll, we'll put this down like so. And then we'll stanchion up this bit here as well. Oh, right, there we go. So we have the foundations in, as I say, for this Wind Dixie. Um, what I'm going to do before we fill it all in is here where this is there is actually another bit is, uh, no there isn't right the door is actually here for the supermarket underneath this so this is here for like the um for the uh like a guide really but what we need to do is we now know that the when you when you can do it the right way and not get we'll fill the roof in because the outline for this is the most important part and it's not going to get any higher than this 
it might be a little bit wrong. I've just had to tailor it to Minecraft standard. Um, but you need your smooth sandstone just to fill the roof in. Once it's been filled in, we'll, we need a lot of lighting in this. Like I said, the only windows are going to be at the front. Um, and there isn't going to be that many. Um, there's a window for the entrance and a windows a little bit further down. Just underneath this bit here at the front. So what we'll do is we'll get rid of these now. Because we don't need them. Um, but obviously because of how Minecraft set we can't have things on angles for the front. So here will be the entrance for the supermarket and here will be where the windows um, go otherwise you're just making a big mess in the middle for no reason um, whatsoever so, um, because just because that's how it's going to have to be we are going to have to make a few little changes um, this is the ceiling for the supermarket there is another roof which covers the whole of that from up there um, as well so you know there is like quite a bit of loft space um, in the supermarket so while we prat about getting all this done don't forget to follow my YouTube just search Stu Cox and it will come up um, it's a little funky emblem of my name which is my channel and um, it's growing all the time to be fair we've got quite a lot quite a nice new number of subscribers on it then this month we've had nine which is quite good quite uh, quite nice like I said before I don't really do this for the money side because I don't get paid for it I do it because I enjoy it it's um, been a big help during lockdown during the pandemic and uh, I've met some great people on Twitch who I'm sure I'll speak to many, many, many years uh, to come. But with the ceiling as well, um, because I have just prat about with the, because there is a bakery. So the bit that sticks out on this side is the bakery, like the in-store bakery. The rest is going to be rows of bookshelves um, and we're going to have loads of lighting like the strip lights are basically going to run all the way down the shop because this bit here is going to be the shop. So what we'll do is we'll get the brick, we'll get some We'll get, the, we'll get the slabs out here and we need to run the slabs all the way along here along this edge as well and we'll be doing the same at the top when we fill in the actual roof this is just a ceiling to the restaurant remember um, well, what's happened here? Oh yeah, it turns in, doesn't it? Right, so let's get rid of these random floaty bits. Right. Okay, so that now should look something like this 
which is um, quite nice, quite nice to have. And uh, if you are watching, hello there, hello to you. Right, so the roof, same aspect as before. The bricks now need to come up to here all the way around. So it is quite repetitive this this build. Um, what we'll do is to make it easier. I'm gonna do this line here. As you can see off the streams as well, I am doing like the little niggly bits that people don't really want to see me doing, like building the road. Um, I don't think that's quite wise, you know, not many people would start watching it if I went, oh I'm building a, I'm building a new road, not nothing in it, just the actual road itself. Right, so that needs to be there like that, and then the, these going up to where that meets, so uh, like that. Yeah, that looks good. Then get this smooth quartz thing. We take it out one. We then run it across the top here. Not too far. It is worth noting as well that you can basically do any with the bricks any any outline that you want. You don't have to do this extra bit for the bakery. You don't have to have a weird shape, you can just have it in a square. If you're really good at Minecraft, some of the Windixes have a curved front. Now, I'm not that... I, I can copy certain things, but as you saw in the Silver Line and Diner, the curved bar was a bit atrocious. It, it was quite quite bad shall we say um, I could have done better could have done a lot better but I chose chose not to because I, I can because I haven't really got much idea of how to even do survival mode on this and I don't it's only just recently I found out how to do the banner which is why as well I shall prove that I did the banner myself and shout out to um, TSMC um, I was actually watching one of his videos when I found out how to do it so thank you he's a very good builder is um, TSMC I suggest you go check him out on on the YouTubes and the uh, whatnots instas I, th I think he said he was on Instagram but I'm now is inspire me where he builds like generic um, things like an ice cream stand and like plushies and whatever. I thought why don't we try and build some actual buildings from around the world. Like soon I would like to try something out of America to build. Um, the, only, the only problem is there's that many countries I don't actually know what. Like I'd like to I have a hand at a football stadium and um, try something like that. I'd also like to have a little community where between us we um, we build a city. I think that could be quite good as well. Um, yeah. Right. Let's get this bit built then. Up and down, up and down, up and down we go. Don't forget to order some merch off me if you're watching. The links are there. You're helping me out big time. Right, okay. So, I've, I've fucked this bit up already. Excuse my French. Uh, but we need to go down to there like so. We'll then get the quartz slabs. 
and we'll take it all the way back to this end and go out by one when we when we went there there we are we've we've made it we've made it we've only got this bit to, left to do now for the top and then we need the smooth sandstone again to fill in the roof which shouldn't take that long and then it's just filling in the walls at the bottom um, but for the walls at the bottom we will be using smooth sandstone because obviously it's the supermarket and the supermarket bit and you don't really see bricks <laughs> if you go to like Asda's or Sainsbury's or whatever, wherever you are in the world you tell me a supermarket where you, <laughs> you go in and you actually see bricks you, you don't um, so that needs to be there like that so when it's like this this is actually w what it looks like this is how it should look right, I'll tell you what we're gonna leave the ceiling the, the roof for a bit and because we've got unwanted guest I am going to put in some lighting which needs to be quite a lot to be fair something that looks a little bit like this which um, yeah is quite big not gonna lie um, doesn't look big on the outside but it is relatively big uh, for this so what we need to do is get some smooth sandstone now and um, we're going to fill in the roof which is just going to be very very repetitive and um, yeah just adds to the dimension of it actually you know, you wouldn't just have this hollow. This would actually be um, an, an extra roof above the ceiling. You know. Yeah, admittedly, when you go to supermarkets, the ceilings are high. But it's probably a false ceiling. Um, 
and then the the roof is separate um, from the ceiling basically I think that's what I meant to say me and late night building uh, me and talking at this time of night usually is a very this is a very very um, rare occurrence uh, I think next time on the builds we're going to be building some houses uh, some various types of houses we'll have some brick houses estate houses um, terraced houses semi-detached mansions you know you name it we'll we'll have it well very diverse this city is going to be right okay so let's just carry on building now um, been streaming 42 minutes we haven't even put the walls in yet this is going to be a very very long build I might just build the outline today uh, and then tomorrow daytime come back and do the um, inside I might just do the inside off stream but we'll see we'll see what happens probably do it all tonight though to be fair you know we need to break some tills some uh, check check out cashier things so all will be good all will go well trust me everything will be a-okay right there we go put this over there like that oh Right, bring that across like so. Bring this bit across like so. And the actual roof and the ceiling have nearly been done. There's going to be a little surprise at the back. There's going to be like a ladder so you can actually get on the roof so the repair people can come and do some repairs. That'll be on this bit. Um, here so that won't actually be there I'm just going to go for a nature break I'll be back in two Right then, we are back. So I won't be long. Right then, so let's get started. Right, so that's going to be the um, emergency access to the roof up the sand bit here. Um, all the sandstones go in here, like so. Apart from at the front, that's going to be all glass. Right.
I'd like to build a hotel as well at some point. Um, that is going to be a very repetitive um, build as well. Look at all the creepers. I wish they'd bog off. Right. Let me just fill all this in. sort the light and out to get rid of all the creepers uh, in a minute. Because we are having this problem where I do really need to try and turn the uh, the creepers off. But um, yeah. It's not, not happening so far, is it? It's not, not going very well. Uh, everything I've built so far, we've had problems with the creepers. Alright, we'll sneak past that glowstone. Oh, speaking of the creeper, there he is up. Just getting blocked in. Be alright when we get all the lights on. We are going to have to put an, like a staff entrance in as well. Um, probably somewhere around here at the back uh, where it's all secreted off like for the warehouse but we'll, we'll come to that one we need to we'll decide where the inside of the supermarket's gonna be and how's it gonna look and where things go um, you can basically build this however in whatever shape you want um, if there's a like if you don't want to build it this shape with the extra bit at the end there you don't have to it's just a rough idea as to how you could do it really you know it's, it's quite good Alright, let's take that up to the top. We are going to have some glass here, I've decided. And only the one entrance, because in England you don't really get... I know it's an American supermarket, but... Yeah, you just... Yeah. And we're not actually going to have a door in the entrance. I'll show you what I'll be doing in a moment. Um, right, so that's a glass in there like so we'll get back to the sandstone and we'll put this in like this I don't know when the next build will be because um, obviously I want to start streaming other things uh, as well I'm not a Minecraft streamer just stream random games uh, games that I feel like I want to share with you at the time like I told everybody that I was building this yesterday but circumstance uh, meant that I couldn't so there was a slight issue with Twitch where I couldn't get on the stream manager and when I checked the stream 
uh, on the stream dashboard thing, uh, it was quite bad. Yeah, it wasn't very good. Right, the upload speed was shot and everything. Right, we need to go in three more each side uh, with this sandstone. Take it up to the top like so. Oh, grown fond of this. You know, I'm starting to not learn the tricks of the trade. Um, but kind of get the hang of building things. I wouldn't know how to like make sandstone or whatever in survival. But you know, it's a it's a good learning experience. This, it, even if it is creative, you know, you can. Oh, we need to go three down uh, as well. Yeah, because uh, obviously then the, you don't need a door that big. Uh, three sandstone down and then two glass and then once we've done this I'll show you what we could have versus right so basically this two glass it doesn't just go down it goes up as well so you go oh, one button So we go down two. Up two. So the front, when I get out, should look something like that which to be fair I'm quite happy with that it looks rather good it does look nice um, yeah right let's get some lighting in the place with it being so so big Just enough to get rid of the creepers, you know. It needs to be very big, very bright. Let's see where it's dark, so what we'll do is we'll get up high. We'll put some lights in across the wall. Just because we can. It's not going to hinder anything. Come back here, we're going to wait you over me blue concrete. Not again. Can't even put it in. Right, there we go. Right, okay, so. Let's just have a look round. I'll show you how it should be. This is going to be awkward because there's going to be no doors on it. Oh, I know what we need. Um, right, so it's entirely up to you if you do this. I'm going to do this for effect. Uh, get some... Uh, 
There we go. Look at that. Oh yeah. Now we're cooking. Cooking on gas. Right, okay. So, get rid of all that. Don't need that now. Let's just get a bloody sword just to kill all these idiots off. <laughs> Don't mess with me. Uh, for the next one, I'm going to turn these off. I know this is the old point of Minecraft, but they're starting to do my head in. Um, right, okay. Let's just get that. And then what we need here... Some birch planks. Two, three, four, five across. Well, actually, what we need to do is then get a trap door on the top of that one. Get rid of that. And then we need some clear glass. Just glass on the top here of the display cabinet. Like so. The random bricks kind of break up the um, effect a little bit as well, so it's all good. Even if it does look a little bit odd, it's fine. But you do see the odd. Um, like foundation of how it's built, don't you? So, inside it's full of lights. There's a spider with a. It's alright, I need to get rid of this anyway for the floor. Not very good defence if there's no um, no flooring. You just walk underneath the. Uh Trap door. I think what it was called then. watching and you know press that follow button make a dream come true as I try and get to 150 followers uh, right then there we go Usually just this kind of stuff down, ain't it? Nice 
durable material. I know terracotta ain't great, but it looks like a supermarket floor, doesn't it? That finally made to last crap. Well, I've remembered how to do it randomly. Right, back we go. Well, that's across the front. Now we're going back to near the bakery, and there, there's our first lap done. Right, this bit's already been started. In, without looking at the ceiling. Right. I hate this bit. This is the tedious bit, the floors. It's uh, quite boring, to be fair. Yeah, um, I hope you are enjoying the streams as they're coming out thick and fast. And with it being nearly midnight, we'll be uh, live again on Thursday doing something. I don't know what yet. Um, unsure what to play at the moment. Don't know what to do. We'll uh, decide when when it happens. Um, Right, I haven't really got a schedule. I know that I want I need to play some more GeoGuessr. Um just for shits and giggles and whatnot. But um Yeah. I need participation. And when you're just playing against yourself, it's uh, it's not the same. No matter how much you advertise, people never never seem to join. I have the odd few people come in like that prat from earlier saying can you build what you think my skin is I'm like no I'm building what I'm saying on on the title you know I hope his name wasn't Windixie that'd be a bit weird wouldn't it but it is what it is and um, I'm very very surprised that I haven't had a do you want to buy some followers Right, no, I don't. You know, I want I want to earn my followers the hard working way. Not by spending money I haven't got trying to get them, if that makes sense. Because I bet none of them watch anything. They'll just be there. And my downfall for affiliate is average views. So um or one seven. But um you know, it, it'll get there eventually. It's just taking a little bit of time and a little bit longer than what I expected. But I did have quite a lot of time off um, at the end of last year, beginning of this year, with my well-documented reasons. Right, so we'll put that there. Uh, we'll then destroy the rest of this grass. I'm struggling to see now, so 
you know, I'll probably do the interior in the morning when I wake up and I'm a bit more awake. Um, but I'll certainly get the floor finished. Um, see part of this one, which is uh, new to you all, isn't it? Bet you feel well excited about that. Right, let's uh, get all these down. The interior will be built tomorrow because I am struggling at the moment to keep my eyes open and I don't know whether I'm coming or going. I might even finish the floor off tomorrow uh, as well because it is gone midnight and usually I'm in bed for about 10. So, you know. Right, let's go back like that and put in the floor. Um, yeah, I'm going to finish this tomorrow because I am struggling to see at the minute. My eyes are watering. Um, but I'll finish the floor because there's only this little bit left. And when I actually hit the right tiles. Take out the odd bit of white terracotta, that doesn't matter. Because obviously, we're still going to have it on us for the time being. Um, the tills are actually quite easy to make. Um, it's just finding a place for them. I'm thinking over here by the windows, we have like three tills. Um, and then people can just pay say here here and a bit further down here uh, and then walk around and then walk out of the supermarket slash bakery slash whatever else the bloody do I ain't got a clue but uh, the building looked nice so the banner and the uh, interior like the cash points the cashiers whatever else it was that will be coming along tomorrow daytime um, at some point as a part two on youtube uh, for the people watching this on youtube a little bit later than when it goes out this has been recorded on the 30th of june slash first of july and the flooring is nearly very, very nearly done. Right, and the, no, there we have it. One supermarket floor in. The walls and the front have been done. Just need to put the banners on in the morning, so I'll get a loom ready. Uh, for that. So um, yeah, that's it for now. Join us tomorrow uh, for part two of this on YouTube, and just a continuation uh, of us finishing off the interior of this supermarket, the Win Dixie supermarket. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get a loom.
so tomorrow we need some bookshelves from there. Right, so the loom and that's ready for the morning. Just take one, one final look of the supermarket. I'll do a little fine visit round. So that'll be the front, obviously. This is the side. Oh, yeah. And we'll put the ladder in at some point tomorrow as well. So if you have been watching, thank you. Uh, if you want to follow, hit follow. If you're watching this on YouTube and you don't already, hit that subscribe button and uh, help me out. Also give it a like, thumbs up, comment what you else you'd like to see me build in this world and uh, I'll see you again soon. Take care everybody. Goodbye.